guys. Let me lock my window. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So guys, in today's video, I'm going to I'm going to make half cast body lotion. Yeah, guys, I'm going to be making half cast body lotion, and uh, this lotion belongs to someone. So I'm going to introduce you to all my ingredients and my recipe. So before then, guys, if you're new to my YouTube channel and you like what I do, please do subscribe to my YouTube channel and make sure to turn on the notification bell to be getting every of my upload. And thanks to you all. Thanks to my old and new subscribers. Thank you for your support. Thank you for the good comments. Like, thank you guys. Since I opened my channel, my channel, I have never received any bad comments. Thank you all for believing in me. So guys, let's go straight to the video of today. This is my base cream. And this is 300 grams of base cream. So you can use any base cream of your choice. This is my base cream. I made this myself. If you want to know how to make your own base cream, you can check my videos. I have about two or three videos where I made a base cream. Yeah, guys, if you're going to be making your half cast body lotion, guys, you need to use a base cream that has no lightning effect on it. This base cream is just simply water and oil, was and my steric acid there is nothing like any whitening additive inside this base cream because if you're using a base cream that have whitening additive and you're still going to add another whitening additive to it guys it's going to give you green veins it's going to give you dark knuckles it's going to give you patches you are not going to like it so guys i have my snow white powder yeah, this is my Snow White powder, and uh, this is um, 15 grams. I'm using 3% of my, all the powders that I'm using, they are all 3, sorry guys. Yeah, 5%, I'm sorry, 5% of 300 grams. So I'm going to leave the, I'm going to leave the uh, measurements below my description box. So, and this is my Giga White powder, and... This is my glutathione powder. And this is my Nacinamide powder. So guys, if you're making your body lotion, take note. You must not add different type of powder in your formulations. So I'm using just four different type of powder. I see some people do add about 10 different type of powders. They are still going to add kojic acid to this. They are still going to add alpha abutin to this. They are still going to add vitamin see to this guys that is wrong yeah guys you have to pick two or three powders and add it together because there are some powders that you cannot incorporate with the other powders yeah guys you cannot like um vitamin a powder you cannot mix vitamin a powder and vitamin c powder together they don't go well it's going to irritate your skin so you must not add everything like you just want to be selfish then you're just going to add almost 10 powders together it is not done that way just use few powders and if you use them in the right percentage it's going to work well on your skin that is it guys i have so many powders in fact i have all lightning powders but i pick this four to work with hold on guys so i pick this four to work with this is my nacinamide powder here is my glutathione powder here is my snow white powder and i have other powders also but you just have to pick few powders and work with it you don't need to add everything together so i have my other stuff also so let me turn my camera i have my other stuff also my oils and my things here so by the time i'm adding it i'm going to be explaining further so guys let's continue so the first thing that i will be doing i'm going to dissolve all my powders i'll be dissolving all my powders there are some powders you have like my snow white powder 
This is my Snow White powder. I have to dissolve with my glycerin. So that is it guys. I have to dissolve my Snow White powder with my glycerin. And my glutathione powder, I have to dissolve with my water. My alpha abutin powder, I have to dissolve with water or glycerin. And my niacinamide powder, I have to dissolve with water. So guys, stay tuned. Let me dissolve these things because I don't want this video to be too long, guys. So I am back. I hope you all can see this. Guys, this is my glutathione. Oh my god. Hold on. This is my glutathione powder. It's fully dissolved now. You can see how clear this water is. You don't need to do the double boiling method. It's just going to dissolve well with cold water. Just normal water. So now I'm going to add my glutathione. And this is my this is my alpha abutin. Sorry guys, <laughs> this is my giga white powder, guys. I hope you all can see this and this is my snow white powder you just have to do the double boiling method with glycerin you can see how pure this what this uh, uh, snow white powder came out some people do complain that they cannot dissolve their snow white powder yeah guys so I use glycerin to dissolve my own snow white powder and I'm going to add it here And now I'm going to, this is my Afa Abutin powder, where it dissolves is now purely water. This is it guys. So I'm going to add it also. And I'm done with all my powders. Like I, like I said before guys, you don't need to complicate your body frame. Yeah, everybody wants to get light, but uh, <laughs> you have to be careful while doing it. You don't need to add so many whitening powders into your formulation. So now I'm just going to mix all these powder. I'm going to incorporate them together before I can start adding my other additives. So guys, stay tuned. So now I'm going to be adding my oils and I'll be adding my handmade carrot oil. I'm going to leave the link below my description box so you can also watch how I make this oil. So I'm using 20 ml. And also, this is my pimento oil, which I also made myself. And also, I'll be using 20 ml. My orange oil, this I also made myself. So guys, make sure to check my playlist. So I'm using 20 ml also. Make sure to check my playlist. I have so many DIYs videos that you are going to love and learn from it. And I'll be using my Skin Free Mix. And I'll be using 20 ml. Guy, you don't need to do it over. You don't need to add too many stuff on your cream. 
in your cream guys not on <laughs> and i'll be adding my uh, sheer butter extract so adding just a few drops and also i will be using my nano white so i think i'm just going to empty this because it's not much you can see it's not much so wow and my pineapple oil and made pineapple oil 20 ml guys it's winter here it's winter here so don't blame me if i'm adding too much of oils i'm going to add my alanton powder but not now so this is my uh lightning glycerin that i made myself so i wanted to add this glycerin to this but just because i added i used my glycerin to dissolve my snow white powder maybe i will just be adding a little more just little so that i can have the benefit of the lightning effect on it so now i'm going to stir this So guys, now I'm going to add my Alanton powder. I used to scoop and I'm going to dissolve also with my water. I'm going to allow it to dissolve. So now I'm going to add my alanton powder. And mix them all up. Okay guys, now I'm going to add a little, just a little of my lightning glycerin. So I just want the, yeah, this is, this is okay. Guys, in order to allow all these uh, active ingredients that we added already, in order to allow these ingredients to penetrate, like really penetrate well into our skin, we are going to be adding our propylene glycol. Yeah, guys, I will be adding propylene glycol. And this um, base cream is made with um, lactic acid. So, the lactic acid in this cream is going to help exfoliate your skin while the lightning powders will be doing their job in your skin. Like, really? I never wanted this video to be long, but I think it was worth it. And I'm going to add my preservative. And mix, 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 mix. And I'll be using vanilla fragrance. Because the person that ordered for this cream really loves vanilla. Whenever I add vanilla to her stuff, she really likes it. So guys, I'm done missing everything. And um, this is my 500 grams of my, uh, my container and it's properly washed because i'm re reusing this container so it's properly washed soaked with bleach and spray so 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 i'm going to turn this into my container i need 500 grams okay 
I don't know if you can see this properly. Hundred four sixteen four sixteen. Okay, guys, so it's ready. This is four hundred and sixteen grams, so I don't want to overfull it so that I can the cover will go well with it. So I don't want to overfull it. By the time you overfill it and you cover it, they are just going to pour out so you don't have to overfull your container so guys please make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel give this video a huge big thumbs up huge big <laughs> and uh, share this video with your friends guys please subscribe to my channel the notification bell that one is very important so make sure to turn the notification bell that is how you're going to noti be notified when i drop a new video and i have so many videos coming your way i'm going to be dropping back to back so guys stay tuned i love you all and bye bye <laughs>